2013 so far has been the year of 3D, not 3D tellies with 3D printers. Kickstarter is awash with printers of the third dimension and we can print anything from a gun to a pair of shoes. But what can we print right now and what will we be able to print in the future? We're here to talk to the pros to find out everything you need to know about 3D printing. 3D printers have been around for a fair few years now, but it's going through something of a boom this year. But how does it actually work? We take three-dimensional CAD data in STL format, and then we have some software that interfaces with the machine. We split the CAD data up into a series of layers or slices, then gets sent to the machine. The machine builds it in layers, and then, hey presto, at the end, you get the model. Laser lines have printed everything from parts of an F1 car to models of an Aston Martin and we'll soon be able to print almost anything in our homes with the emergence of desktop 3D printers. We're talking shoes, new body parts or anything you can download from Thingiverse as an STL file, the type needed for a 3D printer. But it's a minefield. Here's some top tips from our expert if you're looking to become a 3D printer aficionado. Okay, the five things I would look out for if I was going to buy a desktop 3D printer would be obviously price is a massive consideration. Also the material that is available for the printer. The size of the printer would be very important, so how big are your parts or models going to be. Uh, also uh, whether it be an open source uh, piece of equipment or do you want a turnkey solution, cradle to grave, with uh, one manufacturer giving you the whole solution. Also as well, uh, big hook would be how easy is the printer to use. And what will the future hold for 3D? Drugs? Food? In the future for 3D printing uh, I think will be materials driven. The biggest use for these systems is the actual materials it can print in rather than the actual technology. Being able to print maybe in full colour. Also as well I think the metals market will become more mature in the next 5 to 10 maybe 15 years. If you'd like to know more about 3D printing, head to your closest newsagent and pick up a copy of T3 from the 27th of March and keep it locked to T3.com.